welcome back to One Shot. I'm Dear Darling, and as we guide Nico while the world decays around them, ooh, wait, too soon? Uh -huh. Oh well, um, we've opened up uh, the, the blackclover.exe file, which is in One Shot, and I have looked it up, there was a new game plus, so I immediately um, just was like, how do I start it? And then the first thing I saw was open up uh, the blackclover.exe file, and that's it. <laughs> uh, so we'll take it, I suppose, from here. So let's go. I, I don't know whatever do this new game plus is, which is hopefully different enough to, to warrant doing more Let's Play. These sort of games, they tend to be, is what I'd say. <laughs> so, anyway, looks like you completed your mission in the world, and I understand. I know you wish to return, but the entity called itself one shot for a reason. Uh, that restriction was implemented a long time ago. Removing it is impossible now, well, at least for me. I do not know the full extent of your power, so pardon me if it sounds foolish, but if you would be so kind to test something out for me. A log of your save progress may exist somewhere on your machine, um, a save file of course. Maybe even in the same location as this journal you're reading right now. Um, maybe, I don't know. Uh, uh, if the save progress log takes the form of a file, perhaps you can manipulate it. Try removing it from its current location. A simple deletion will do. Again, I apologise for not knowing the extent of your powers. If what I described confuses you, I'm sorry. Uh, sure. Well, I think we certainly can. I wonder if we can open this again if it says something different. Nope. Uh, okay, uh, which one of these is my one-shot <laughs> save file? Data, I guess? No, da data would be other things. Um, so you can't exactly see what I'm doing. I should probably just port it and just actually just um, look, look through the stuff and see which one it is. It's definitely not going to be graphics or anything. Languages? No. Wallpaper? No. Dot EXE? Credits? Re read me? Wh wh which of these is meant to be my... my you know what? Hold on. I'll pause this vlog. <laughs> and then I'll, uh, I'll tell you what I find. I found it. Um, it is uh, was in a different folder because I moved where I installed a one shot game to um, a different thing. But uh, it turns out they they save this document and document slash my games slash one shot, which is not exactly where I've saved um, one shot. So I, I have it in fact installed on a different drive. But hey ho, here we go. Uh, we did that. Did that work? The black clover. It's just a black clover once more. And I suppose we'll open up one shot. No, no, we won't. Um, okay, well I opened it and it was the bedroom and now it's not the bedroom. Now it's just back to usual old one shot. So we're going to see if there's actually anything different, which hopefully it is. Hello? Hello? Game? Okay, start. No? No? Hold on. You know what? It's probably because this isn't opened with Steam. <laughs> Let me fix this. Okay, there, there we go. We're, we're on Steam now. Um, it's because I'm using a Steam controller. Steam won't, uh, the game won't recognise it as a controller. Um, and as I open up through Steam. So there we go. Oh, hello. This is definitely different. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> hello again, Nico. Sorry to bring you back. Or welcome back, I suppose. I don't I don't really know if this is the same Nico we sacrificed or... He hello? D dear? Huh? Wait. Why did I say that word? Dear. Why does that sound so familiar? Hello again. Nico just woke up here. I wonder if we can talk to the entity again. A wither plant sits here, stiff and dry, a branch snaps off. I guess we just do the same things as, as normal. Definitely, something's different. Um, Nico has recognised us. I don't know if that's just from the beginning or or not. It's too dark to read in here. Oh, we start with a journal. Wait, did we start with a journal? No, we, we found it somewhere, right? A soft glowing light. But there's also no remote anymore to... Um... Wait, where's... What? Dust, dusty books. Oh, input password. Password hint. Documents. Ah, do documents. <laughs> okay, well, well, it's either in the documents where I actually saved one shot where some other things were. Which it doesn't seem to be, so it's probably in my, a my actual main folder documents. Uh, what's it going to be? It's going to be my games, one shot, readme.txt maybe? Um... <laughs> I don't see anything of note. What if I open the black clover again? Not useful. Read me. Does it have a password in here? Not that I can see. Uh, <laughs> um. Hmm. I think I might. Oh, one shot password. Here we go. Ah, okay, uh, I need to make another screen capture, I suppose, to, to do this. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Um, 
sorry it's a little bit scuffed but it's just so you can see it and I can also read exactly what's going on but it looks like you're able to remove a restriction in that case you're ready to continue but necessary preparations are already in place recession might run a very different course depending on your actions if you can recognize my symbol you will know what to do if, if you can recognize my symbol you know what to do uh, oh hold on I just realized it's capital S so I was capital O I confess it will be risky. The probability that the entity's condition will worsen is quite high, and if that happens, then, then, <laughs> look at me, asking you for favours only, L, to become so apprehensive once you agreed. Oh wait, is that NC the, the squares? I didn't even realise that. <laughs> I'm so dumb. What's this spending out? So souls? Souls? Um, I understand if you wish to leave some questions unanswered. I understand if you do not believe in a happy resolution. I understand if you are simply afraid of what might happen, because... I'm afraid too. If you enjoy the world as is, if you are satisfied with the story as is, if you really do not want to see anything change for better or for worse, then pretend you, pretend you never saw this. Carry the session as you would normally. Do not use my journal for anything other than what you were already familiar with. This option will always remain for you though. Sol sol solstice probably, yeah. That's why I implore you to consider the messiah of the world, my children. They all deserve a good ending. Thank you for listening. Goodbye. Well, you're not saying if doing this is the good ending, <laughs> um, for better or for worse. Well, we gotta, we gotta try. Oh, oh, hold on, sorry, I forgot to reveal these images. These are the other images I read out. Um, but they go and hide these away now. Sorry, a lot of captures. Um, I guess we type in solstice. Uh, that certainly seems like the most sensible course of action. Um, I don't. Does it need to be capitals? I didn't really pay attention to that. I already closed it, but I'm going to assume um, it's written like an actual human being would write a word. Access granted. Oh, hello, entity again. You found me. Why? You're already too late. Not much of the world remains. This will be apparent once you go outside. But this place was never worth saving. Do you still want to try? Of course. Then remember this. Your actions here will affect Nico. Your mission is to help Nico leave. And most importantly, no, this does not feel right at all. Have we already been through this, dear? But that should be impossible. You only had one shot. I wasn't supposed to exist after that. Well, sucks to you. You have, we have two shots. Nico hears the sound of a door unlocking. Dear, that sounds so familiar. It won't turn on. Is it me or the sound got so loud for a second? And I have no idea. Uh, oh well, we'll leave. Hello? Anyone? No. TV gives off a dangerous looking spark. I guess we'll sort of just like speed run through. It doesn't manage to light. Oh. Wooden fireplace. Looks like it was never used. Looks like it could be lit. But it doesn't light. Weird. Okay, so we have to do something else. Sink one turn on. Inside refrigerator is a bottle of alcohol. Oh yeah, no, hold on. We have to do this first. Nico dips a branch into alcohol. Was this always how it was, um... Told to us? Before Nico started talking to us, I suppose? Ah! And we pick up this and it's like a key on the ground. Small metallic object, we to crack on the floor. Nico digs it out. And we'll go get the sun, basement key. We'll see what about this world is so different. What can we do differently? So apparently we're meant to use this guy's, uh, the right to... The, the, the creator, the, the author's journal somewhere and it's meant to be different um, you know there were actually quite a few areas which were restricted so I wonder if we're meant to use them there like we're meant to use them at the, the mines in the barrens or um, uh, the, the, the place to the cemetery in uh, pff, the glen was that one? Oh, and we can maybe we can use that other tree with a fox spirit I'm trying to think where, where else we might be able to use it um I'm not sure what other restricted areas there were. There's a lot of areas restricted, um, I assume, by the entity of the cubes, but... Oh, well, we can, we'll figure it out as we get there. So that's the important part. For now, everything looks the same. I guess we'll go and try and talk to people. We'll, we'll, do, we'll do things very speedily that we already know how to do since we've already talked to everyone. It doesn't really matter. Don't know how we got here. Um, what's left of a computer terminal? We're going to do our best to try and speed through the things we've already seen and find that divergent point. 
because it seems like we can play through this game as normal, is what um, the author was basically implying. Um, if you just play through this game as normal, just pretending you didn't see the journal, um, you can do whatever you want and just play the normal base game. But we're not here to do that. We're here to explore further into New Game Plus. So hello, Prophet Bot. Ah, that light bulb. You are here. Uh, me? Yes. Welcome to our world, friend. I'm most humbled by your presence, yes. Um, uh, thanks. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little lost. All oh, right, allow me to explain some things. May I first ask how you arrived here? I'm not sure. I welcome this weird house. It was really dark. Oh, so you woke up in a very dark location, just my prophecy was told. Okay, but this is exactly the same from what I recall. Please ask me anything. Can you tell me about uh, this world? I'm not sure where I am exactly. I can't see too far off. Everything's so dark. Oh, it has not always been this dim, nor was it so broken, but time waits on no one. Not even save this world. It's divided into three regions. You're on the fringe right now, the barons at the tower. You see the distance from the tower of the sun. And so that's what that told me. As you go further towards the center, you will cross other regions. There should be a map still in the outpost somewhere. Ooh, can you tell me about the light bulb? Uh, I think this is still the same. Water still hanging on by Fred. Element of phosphor, now is the only source of illumination when light last dies in World War II. Now you're here with sand, we need to get to the tower, your pilgrimage it shatters. When I wake up in that house, for some reason they called out a name. Dear, I'm not sure why I did that, but then I saw it on a computer too. Ah, oh, that would be our god. Oh, right. I think... I feel like I remember something about that. You... You, you do? But, but wait, did you not just arrive here? I was the one who was supposed to inform you of that. So, how did you know? Hmm. It just made sense, I guess. Oh. Have, have you already contacted Devon? No. Nope. I just had to close my eyes and focus, right? Nico, it's good to see you again, buddy. Hey, dear. God? It's gonna sound weird, but have we met before? Yep. Ah, oh, but I don't know who you are, though. It's just a weird feeling that I have. Oh, I bet I'm just being really silly. I don't know, you know, oh... You know, the me IRL, the embarrassing moment where the friend comes up to me and I go, Hey, who are you? And we're like, oh, I'm your best friend. You don't remember that? Oh, awkward. <laughs> Sorry. That's not, even, that's not even a joke. I don't even know what that was. Sorry, but it's it's nice to meet you, dear. My name's Nico. I just contacted dear, yeah. Do not be afraid to ask dear for assistance. You are the messiah, after all. Can you tell me about going home? Don't mean to be rude, but I don't know how to get here. I want to go home. Your mission save the world. I'm sorry. Um... I think that's all I had to answer now. Excellent. I wish you luck. So we're going to speed run um, through what we can. Uh, we need like a, a crowbar or something. It hasn't even been that long since we've done this area. So you would have thought I'd remember how to do these things. But I, d I honestly don't. <laughs> I kind of want to check out the mines. Because I bet we're going to go to the mines and we're going to be like, Ooh, look, you can go through now for some reason. That's a very sort of new game plus thing to do. I'd imagine. So I was saying, I find it suspicious that we can't go to the mines. Mm, bit pretty sus, if you ask me. So that's what we're going to do now. I can't remember where... No, we, we had to flatten... We had to flatten a strip of metal into a crowbar, right? And that's how we open the crate and get a battery? Maybe? <laughs> I don't really recall. Um, I don't remember what was over here. This was... Uh... Oh yeah, this was the safe. I wonder if we could just get into the safe now. Hold on. Wait, maybe the safe doesn't exist. Maybe we've already opened it? Oh, it seems like the way's been blocked off to the safe. Yeah, wasn't it the path is like here somewhere? Or maybe it's here. Am I the safe? Looks like it's locked with six digit code. Enter code. I don't remember off the top of my head, unfortunately. Unless it's like 62403. I don't really know how it works. I guess we're gonna open it and then there's gonna be nothing in there? I'm, I'm curious. I've got to see what happens now. So I don't want to this is my name. She's in darkness. This was some mysterious person who we didn't even know. Let's go try and talk to Silver. Be like, yo, Silver, what's up? Miguel, I remember you. You remember me? It's your buddy, old Nika. Well, I guess Nika doesn't remember. It's your buddy, dear. A robot. Uh, you're one like looking over to the Vista or something. I want to go to the mines. Oh, hello. A light bulb. So you are the messiah? That's not been told. I expect someone taller doesn't look like kids. In fact, you are. I'm a person. You've got the four legs. Can messiah a robot? This can sound cold, but if your world has been falling apart, you really see. I don't know. I really can't leave. <laughs> so, skipping for everything. We're, we already know all of this. What's inside the tower? Okay. Um, if it's not the mines being the divergent point, I, I don't really know what the divergent point is. But this is the only thing I can think of, which was something which was unresolved. 
Wait. So I guess we sort of like read from a passage and something's going to happen in my mind. I saw you heading this direction, minds have been abandoned. My duty is accompanying you because it's so far exactly the same. Hmm. I don't know what we use it on, I'll be honest, but... <laughs> Do be careful in here. Little, little gadget. The camera, oh yeah, with the screwdriver. Oh yeah, we need to take a screwdriver from your place. I was going to use an empty bottle on you, but it doesn't make any sense. Uh, you don't read this book. Look, there's a black clover, hold on. Can we use it on you? Ah, oh, I really thought we could. Okay. Um. I don't even know what that was. Ah, uh, you okay? You were starting to black out. I, I saw something. Hmm? It was like a really short a dream just now. Oh, I saw something like a robot with a yellow eye. That's strange. Are you sure you're okay? <laughs> yeah. You know, now that you mentioned it, there is a robot who always insisted on going back to the abandoned mines. Is that the author? Despite how long the mines have been in disrepair, I hope he's okay. He doesn't look broken or anything, he, but I didn't really see him see him, you know? Like I said, it was kind of like a dream, and he was up close. Sounds like some kind of visual glitch. Just like these weird rocks that sort of like have appeared in the screen, or his hallucination. Whatever it is that, li that living beings have. Hmm, did that... Robot, you know I have a yellow eye. I don't think I've seen any other robots like that. I would not know. I never met him myself. Only heard of him from a friend of mine. Your friend, huh? Hold on, something in my pocket is. The journal. Wow, it's glowing. What? That wasn't glowing before. What is this? That was going to be my question. Where did you get that book? Oh, uh, it was with me when I woke up back at the house. I didn't really question it at the time. I flipped with a couple of pages, but I didn't understand a word. Is that just something the size I was supposed to wake up with? No. I have never heard of anything like that. But I know who wrote the book. Oh? However, I've only seen his books with a black clover on the cover. If he went through the trouble of putting yellow phosphor in it, and the fact that you woke up with it in the first place, really has me intrigued. Yellow phosphor? Oh yeah, that's a rare phosphor that people think the sun is made of, right? Wait a minute, how do I know this? I don't think anyone's told me about it. Ah, I can show you if you'd like. My friend gave me this a long time ago. Pretty. Hmm, so that's how we get the amulet. Oh, looks like there's a clover in the necklace too. Like a book. Well, it is the same person. Oh. That's why I think this journal would be important. You said it just started glowing? Yeah. That was right after your vision then. This has to mean something. Maybe you should at least try to read it again. All right. Ow. Um, there's a glowing minecart. Oh, I found this page. It looks like, kind of like a drawing of this room. Maybe it's telling us we should come here, which we did already. So it looks like we're on the right track. I see, so we... Maybe you should inspect the journal a bit closer. Is it... I bet the black clover is like where we're meant to stand. I've been open the journal. And poof, minecart. Boom, look at that. Wait, I wonder if we're meant to do other stuff first. What just happened? I'm not sure. I wasn't looking. To be honest, neither was I. I was taking a closer look at the journal. And then I found this page that looks like a drawing of this room. When I looked back up, the minecart just showed up out of thin air. Should I be worried? Hmm. This looks like a standard issue minecart though, which means it li likely detected a motion in this room and sent itself over. Ah, that does make sense. I'm just surprised it still works. Guess that means we'll have a working vehicle now. Not sure why you'd want to visit the deeper mines, but if you wanted to, we now have that option. So I guess we had to do stuff as normal, but also we had to do something in the mines to progress our New Game Plus story. Is that minecart even going to fit both of us? No, but I wanted you to come with us. I know I've got deer, but... Honestly, this place gives me the creeps. Oh, I can still come with. I would just have to follow along on the rails. But doesn't it look a little precarious? Magnetic rails can hold me in place. It only, it's only ever dangerous to walk on if you're an organic being, which you are. Ah, I gotcha. All right, so I guess we'll go. I'll be waiting here if you need me. Sure, I mean, why not? It's something new. Okay, here we go. Hopefully it's not a, a point of no return. 
Oh, we can sprint on a minecart, which I, I don't really think that makes much sense. Come on, Silver. You can't sprint. How much further into the mines we go? It's, it's quite eerie. I want to keep Silver on my screen. You got anything to say, Silver? Hello. Do you need anything? Nah. Okay. Hello again. Hello. <laughs> I do not recognise this place in the protocol. This... This isn't what I'm supposed to be showing you at all. How did you get here? I can only think of one person. He contacted you? How long has he been doing this? A while now. It doesn't matter at this point. You're going out of bounds. You should turn back. Please turn back. Bad things are going to happen. Very bad things. At this rate, Nico will be in danger. Please turn back. Oh. Hmm? What's wrong? I have a bad feeling about this all of a sudden. Feels like I should not be here. Ah. Do you want to head back then? I don't know. What do you think, dear? Should we head back? Continue forward. Dear said we should keep going. Alright. We got. We can't even go backwards because of you. That, that's how we go backwards, I see. Um, so I don't really know what's going to happen. Silver, you're slowly slipping away from us. If there's a bad feeling, which is bad, because I wonder if I should not be doing this yet. I thought I suppose we can reset the game if it turns out not to be the case. <laughs> but, um, obviously, I, I, I'm still searching for that good ending for everyone here. And I assume this is a way to do it. Oh, the cut stopped. Looks like this is as far as the track goes. So, where are we? One of your observation rooms. Looks like it's still mostly intact. Oh, hello. What? Huh? The tunnel just reactivated, but the power was cut off so long ago. Weird. Maybe it runs on battery? No, that's not it. Whatever it is, I need to investigate. Okay. Will you be okay by yourself for a bit? Don't worry, deals with me. Alright, stay safe. Question is, are you going to be okay? Some sort of computer. How's it going? Not ideal. Looks like the terminals are running on a completely separate power source. I can't really recognise any of the data formats on this terminal either. This is all new. Or at least encrypted. I will need to analyse it through my own system. It might take some time, so you don't need to stay. I really hope nothing bad's going to happen to you, huh? Some sort of small machine. I wonder what it does. I can feel my hair standing up a little. <gasps> it's robot person. I... I recognise that light in your eyes. You're the person I am destined to meet. Oh, are you are you the the the, the not the machine? What what are you called? The person. What is your name? I'm Nico. Do you know who sent you? Oh, um no. Wait, do you mean who sent me to this world? There was a robot while back who told me how I'm the Messiah and stuff. So I'm guessing they sent me? With them being God and all. Technically, I guess, by op me opening this game. Robot looks a little bit like you, even. Maybe you know each other? A little bit presumptuous. I cannot say. Oh? Uh, a lot of my memories have been removed for some safety reasons. Your memories were removed? That's terrible. Wait, I'm guessing that's less of a big deal for a robot. I'm going to assume you do not know who sent you. How did you get here, then? How did you reach this room? Oh, uh, we got here in a minecart. Oh, the minecart wasn't there when you entered the mines, was it? Oh, yeah, yeah. So how did you find it? I didn't really find it. The robot lady thinks it was just a minecart coming to us, but... I remember looking at the journal when it happened, and when I looked up again, the cart was just... there. Poof, just like that. Interesting. Please show me this journal. Okay. What is it going on on your screen back there? Hmm. Then it has already begun. What? Oh, <laughs> is it, they're getting a floppy disk from the head. I, I could not figure out what that was. Um, here. What is that? I'm entrusting you with my main memory disk. You have passed the first test by showing me the book. Now you need to find a way to install a backup. Hmm? Your, your backup memory? Install the... Before you do that, though, someone else is with you, right? Someone aside from dear. A resident of this world. Yeah, the robot lady with red hair. She's in the computer room right now. Then, 
Please do not tell her you found me. At least, not yet. I can't be seen like this. Um, okay. Please help me restore my memory. Bring the disc back once you've found, once you have the backup. Okay. Please. Sure. Residential tracking machine. For reference and explanation of the symbols. Cross medical units are assigned to this building. Robot or robots assigned to this building. Electricity or power cells or supplies is arranged to this building. Can we interact with this? Oh. These are the dormitories, right? Of um, the world. Of that, that city. Profit bat. Profit bot zero. Backup system 1.0. Please insert disk. Yep, that's a computer. Um, like this. Oh, all right. Error backup request denied. What? Dormitory assignments are not up to date. Please configure a resid residential tracking machine to continue. Okay, then. Okay, so we, we had to do what's what, but I can't remember off to my head who's in what building, so we're gonna have to go back to the village to figure it out. Hello, Silver. How's it going? This observation room isn't for the mines. I've actually never been into this particular one. Really? You recognised it at first, though? They all look the same. Fair enough. I did find something interesting, though. All the databases seem to encode video feeds. Right now I can see various places in the barrens. The outposts, the residential areas, even my own house. They're all shot from a top-down perspective, too. Which means the cameras would have to be in the air. But I've never seen any cameras around. That's kind of spooky. I might go investigate later. Yeah. Did you find anything interesting in the back room? You were there for a while. Yeah, we uh, found a dead end. I see. So smooth. Some sort of computer. Oh, found another video feed. I should definitely go look for the cameras later. This is really bothering me. So, story-wise, there we're in a, a video camera feed. Okay, well we need to go to the, the town. I suppose so. Silver, what's gonna sort of let you do whatever while we figure out exactly what we need to do to progress forward? Once more, in this crazy, messed up world, um, before we leave Silver's place, make sure to grab a screwdriver from her house. And we just need to make a note. I can't remember where we get the gas mask. I'll be honest. So let's pick up a shelf, it's a screwdriver. I don't believe we can go up, upwards yet, right? We need a gas mask. And the gas mask is in a factory somewhere? I think we need to power up the robots first. Hmm. I very much can't remember. We also need to find the code. But we can't go this way because if something near here hurts to breathe, so we're not going to go that way. Okay, so this is basically how well can I remember how we played uh, the initial game. <laughs> Which was not that long ago. Um, in your perspective, if you're watching this Let's Play, it was probably only a couple of hours or something. But for me, it was probably like four weeks ago or something. So I, I vaguely remember things. I just don't remember them exactly enough. Gas masks. So keep some for emergencies. I, I know we... Oh, is the gas mask in the, the little box? Is that what's inside of it? So we need to get the crowbar. And the crowbar we get by getting metal and pounding it flat, I think. I don't remember what we get the screwdriver for. Oh no, maybe the screwdriver we use to open the box. I don't know. Should we talk to ProfitBot again, see if ProfitBot's got anything else interesting to say? Hello. More questions? Yes. Um, can you tell me about the Barons? I didn't need to click on that one particularly. I just want to see if he had any new dialogue. Uh, uh, a tower. Okay, so there is nothing new. Um... So it's a very confusing situation that we're in. Oh no, we pop up a lens. That's what we had to do. I don't remember what the lens is for. <laughs> we put the lens in something. I remember that, but I don't remember what else that is. But we might have to continue this next time. Because we are encroaching half an hour. But we can go in this direction, right? Or is it only vents in this direction? There's metal somewhere. That's, that's the only major thing I remember. No, it looks like we can't go in this direction. Is that a building over here? Oh no, this is the dock. This is where the, the person who takes us to the Glen is, right? Hmm. 
Oh yeah, hello. Um, you've been very cubed up, I will say. Oh no, it's some weird square stuff. Uh, okay, so I guess we can't go to the Glen via this entryway anymore. Oh, perfect. Here's the metal thing. And maybe we can go to sleep in the, the bed. And we'll round off this episode here. Let's see. Hold on. I'm a little tired from walking. Is it alright if I take a nap? Of course. So, if you haven't been watching, thank you very much. It's been one shot. I've been Dear Darling. Likes, comments, subscription, shares are greatly appreciated. Join me, Dear Darling, Discord. Follow me on Twitter down below. Hope we see each other again. But for now, it's our farewell. So, until next time. Well, the mystery of one shot, I suppose, will continue. So, bye-bye for now. As we take a rest here. Okay, now. Bye-bye for now. <laughs>